Hi, this is Aldo from ExcelNinja.com. In this video, we'll be looking at how to format individual items on a chart. I've created this chart with very simple information about revenue, and this is uh, what Excel gives me as a standard chart. Um, I want to show something different. For instance, here uh, in August, we only sold $2 million, and there was a reason for it. And so I want to highlight on the graph that particular month so it sort of stands out and I'm able to explain it better. So what I do is I click on the whole series and as you can see the whole series is highlighted now and then I click again and only the month of August is now selected. So that allows me to modify only this particular bar. So what I do now is I right click it and I go to format data point and what I will be doing now whatever I do now is basically going to apply only to that specific data point. So for instance the most obvious way of highlighting something would be to go to fill solid fill and then put it in red. Um, so now you can basically highlight the fact that August was a strange month and you can talk about it in your presentation etc etc. Also be aware that you can change not basically every single data point in a different way. So again click on the series, click again and you'll be basically ending up with uh, September only selected uh, format data point again, I uh, got to fill, solid fill, and this time I change it to green. And you can basically change every single one of these. You might have a color coding for your own company that um, highlights certain months, etc., etc., or whatever piece of information you're showing. So you can individually change whatever you want. This applies also to the data labels. Again, if I click on the data labels, they're all selected. Click again, only one is selected. And what is very useful here, for instance, you can change um, the font. So you can make it bigger. This is size 28 uh, font. Uh, you can change the color of the, um, of the character. So now I'll put it in red and I want to show it with a yellow background. So again this is a very powerful way of highlighting specific pieces of information by formatting individual uh, pieces of information on an Excel chart.